Hey, thanks for tuning in. Just want to do an update video of what's going on with the Impala. Let the brake booster in. So everywhere I've checked, they don't make pre-bent brake lines that go from the proportioning valve down into the system. Because I need one to go from proportioning valve down to this wheel one across to passenger side wheel and then i need a third line to go all the way to the back and they don't make a pre-line pre-bent line for this car which seems really bizarre to me 1964 chevy impala they make every single part in the world for this car anyway that's my gripe my little complaint uh, but the brakes are coming in i'm just going to bend some stuff up make it and make it it's not rocket appliances should be easy uh, front disc brakes are all on front suspensions on I covered that in the last video everything's looking good I well, worked a lot today on the rear disc brakes got the rear disc brakes on both sides shocks everything's on Everything's set up. This is a Curry rear end. It's a Ford 9 inch rear end. Uh, strange axles that's just been modified to work with this car. Let me get under there. I'll show you what we're working with here. So, as you see, it's a Ford 9 inch. And it's all set up for the 64 Impala. Still has high energy urethane bushings and everything under here, like I did in the front. So that's where we're at with this. So it's going to go fast. And it's going to stop fast. What a concept. What a concept. So anyway, that's the update on the 1964 Impala. Ordered a lot of parts. Getting some interior parts on the way. Getting carpet. Dynamat. Door panels. Armrests. All the little odds and ends to put this car together. Okay, so that's how it's going. Stay tuned. I'll have more videos coming up very soon. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. 1964 Impala. Low rod. Hot rod low rider. Okay, stay tuned. Thank you for watching.